The last piece we are going to learn is the pawn. Pawns are weak, by, but they pack a lot of potential. Because if they reach the end, they can promote to any piece that they want to change into. Most often people choose the queen, but in some cases it might not be the best. We choose the most powerful and we collect our, our star like that. So here, again, we first promote it to what we want it to be, and then we collect our stars. On its own, a pawn can actually capture, but it always captures sideways and in front. So in this case, it can capture like that, it can capture like that, and it can capture like that. In this case, it can capture like this. It can go like this. A pawn cannot go past a piece, so it has to capture sideways, capture sideways, promote into whatever it wants to promote into, and capture the stars. In this case, take... If we take here, we are not going to be able to make progress, so we take here, we take there, we take there, we take there, turn into what we want to turn into, and collect our stars. In this particular case, take, makes sense, take, makes sense, push, 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 and this pawn can take like that. We can use the queen to capture and collect all our stars. Here, the first move of a pawn is allowed to jump two, two squares. And once it does that, from there onwards, it can only move one step at a time. And if it's got something it can capture, it takes on the side. So this position, these pawns could go like that. This has to go here to capture this. It has to go there and to capture the last one. We have to go there and capture. That's how a pawn moves. It is slightly complex, but in the future videos, we'll be able to capture more how to use the pawn.